Welcome to Altai from Chiang Mai. This day I take you to, na, to the Elephant Resort. It's about half an hour to an hour away from um, Chiang Mai. Then we go there with taxi, very steep ride to the mountain. And then here you take a pickup from the guys who are in the resort. Then you go down here, very steep, very bumpy. But with this high looks, all wheel drive, off road model, I was very impressed. I stand behind on the pickup here and you have to look a little bit that you don't fall. But the car makes this very, very good. Suspension are very good for this. I was very impressed. I don't found this resort on Google Maps. I think it's pretty much new. But the name is uh, Pupa Elephant Resort. And I will write the name in the description. It cost me 1,500 baht. That's with the taxi and with the entry fee, everything. Then <clears throat> here you can feed elephants, shower them, swim with them in the river. And yeah, that's what you get. Uh, Pupa Elephant Sanctuary. And it's a quite nice resort. Elephants here are not in chain or something, you know, they can move freely. Sometimes I see in Bataya or somewhere they have elephants, they are all in chains. <coughs> here they give him something for drink and uh, the big one and here baby elephant. He's like uh, five months old, I guess they tell me. Yeah, baby elephant, play with shit. <laughs> and yeah, then you can uh, feed them. The big one was hungry, the small one, the baby one not, but he wanna play and you have to be careful. When they are born they are already 100 kilo and uh, this was already heavier then and he tried to push the people around a little bit and uh, when you wear just like flip flops then you have to be careful on your feet that you don't step on your feet, that will be very hurtful I think. The small one chill a little bit with me here at the sitting place. <laughs> you try to eat this stuff, I think. <laughs> yeah, and it's, uh, it was very hot, over 40 degrees. Then here you can give elephant something for drink. They put all in your nose and blow in his mouth. They drink like this. Then yeah, I recommend to um, not in 
not in the high summer to make this. Also generally, Chiang Mai for look stuff travel because it's very very hot. When someone from you live there or know what's the best time in the year for travel to Chiang Mai, Chiang Rai and stuff, then let me know in the comment. The temperature normally I think is uh, very nice, just in the high summer it's very hot, but in winter it can get very nice the temperature, but the air I think from January to March, April is very bad then I think you have to come in the rainy season, maybe. But yeah, but when someone know, please write me in the comment what's the best time. And here you can give them a little shower. And the baby won't play here in the mud. Looks like the baby won't like it. Yeah, then after you make a tour with one elephant, you can walk around over a bridge on the other side of the river. You climb a little bit the hill up here, on the other side down, then you can swim with the elephant. Sadly, I cannot uh, filming how to swim with the elephant because when I walk to the other side, climb the hill up, then my camera get overheated and then not possible anymore. Then I have to let it cool it down first. Then at the end, I just uh, can filming again the way up with the car. So. Sadly, I don't confirm everything. Then here we go for the little hike here. Yeah, for me it was way too hot, but yeah. So then the camera overheated and uh, after that cool down, I just filming the 
way back. Here, very, very steep. Second try. Okay. And yeah, I was really impressed from the car. High looks, all-wheel drive, off-road model. Very good. So now here the rest. Drive back and uh, that was it already from this video. For more videos about my trip to Chiang Mai, in Chiang Mai, subscribe, comment, like, activate the bell. And uh, see you on the next videos guys. Bye bye.